Don't mess with me. Okay. What do you mean? I hold his contract, which makes me his employer. He will do what I ask, when I ask, without question. Oh. You see, Sharon grew up around a very interesting group of individuals. They, well, I guess you could say that they brainwashed him. He is absolutely loyal. To whomever holds his contract, unfailing, like the worst thing you could do. until the day that employment ends. You shouldn't brag about that because then someone just kills Don't get you. Don't me too. wrong. I have no doubt that he holds no end of animosity towards me. But so long as he is my employee, he is as gentle as a teddy bear. <laughs> what was it talking about, Sharon's contract? Oh. Would you now? He's a highly valuable asset to me and to the Ninth Circle. What did you have in mind? Can we work out some sort of deal? I suppose we could do that. Uh, although you might not like the deal that I have to offer. You see, I don't like competition. Not at all. It goes against every principle that I have as a businessman. <laughs> so the fact that there is another source for booze oh, no. in town. Oh no! Oh no! Don't me. tell me. Greta. God. The waitress damn it. <laughs> over at Carol's. I want you to kill her. I don't care how. Just make it quiet. Do it, and you can have Sharon's contract. Why not just have Sharon do it? Loyal employee that he is, Sharon would do it without question if I asked him to. However, the entire town would come down on me for it. Greta is quite popular around here. Oh, yeah. If Sharon is the one who kills her, everyone will know that it was me who ordered Greta's death. I need Sharon clearly visible and in public when Greta dies. So that I can fairly claim ignorance of the situation. Uh. <laughs> no stomach for hard work, eh? No matter. If you don't want. Okay. What can you tell me? Oh, let me see. Let me see the real goods. Why? Whatever do you mean? Okay, these people—they're jetting. Trust me, I know. <laughs> ah, an educated consumer. My favorite kind. Yes. Yes. I. Simply step over here, my friend, and I'll show you my stock of more potent good. Why do you bother to hide what you sell? While there is no law in Underworld, per se, I'd rather not end up at the receiving end of an angry link. There's no shortage of do-gooders around here, and it would be just like them to take it upon themselves to interfere in a fair business trend. Honestly, I have something to sell, and you want to buy it. Now, why? Uh, show you. As you would. Step packs. Obviously. And here's an assault rifle, and. Has. Has a super sledge. And. You know what? Y you know? I think. I think that's about it. Thank you. How is Sharon? Yeah. You smell that. No. Go talk to I just talk. No. <laughs> Go talk. Yeah, but talk. Hey, how's it going? Cool. A human. Uh, yeah, you I know what? Uh I'll give you one thousand cats. Right? I suppose that could work. Yes. Yes. Here's the contract. I'll give you. You. Talk to. Oh no! None of that. <laughs> so that I got good news. I'm your new player. You purchased my contract from Razrakov. So I am no longer. Please wait here. I must take care of something. Okay. Wait. Hey, what's up? 
please do, 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 please do. I am told that I'm no longer in your service. Please kill him, please. You're gonna kill him, right? That's right, Sharon. Have you come? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Yes. Oh that's so wrong. Let's go. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Azrakal was an evil bastard. So long as he held my contract, I was honor bound to do as he commanded. But now you are my employer, which freed me to rid the world of that disgusting rat. And now, for good or ill, I serve you. Oh my god, he shot Azrakal. So do I own the bar? Did you see that? Um Jesus. Yes, what is it? Go. Awesome. I, I have a follower now. That's what the Tyranna guy said to do last time I talked to him. Oh, yeah. And, uh. Okay, time to. I. I thought Sharon liked Azrakal. <laughs> yes, totally. He enjoyed being a slave of an evil bastard. Two. One. Mm -hmm. Go on. Go on. Go on. Okay. I'm going to sell that. I'm going to sell that. Yes, that's luck. And yes, I can see you eye. Yay. Okay. 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 Uh, S and T. Into uh, T. I mean T and S. Into T and S. T and S it ends with a T and an S, right? Because it's yeah. It ends with a T and an S. Right? Wait, hold on. Lots and what else did I get? Hit and lots. Yeah. So a T and an S. Oh, this one, yeah, I was gonna say. So, okay, T and an S. What ends with a T and an S over here? Pet slots. I don't know, guys.
I can't. F oh. Okay. Okay. Let's click this again real quick and check out the notes. He has all sorts of good stuff in his office. I should find a way to get her out of town for a while. So da 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 da. Restock my supply. Here's of course the egghead net release. I love it especially since he got that pastel smooth skin in there. There's no snowflake. What is with this guy? Well, honestly, I don't care. He buys up all my dirt and keeps coming back for more. <laughs> it doesn't really matter if he insists that he is a bother, I guess. Patrick can't say enough good things about this guy, <coughs> about this boy. The only thing is, I need to remember to keep an eye on him. I've caught him behind the counter several times and say that he's more trouble than he's worth, but somehow he just keeps coming up with caps for news. <laughs> There's something up with her. She's become so mopey lately. I wish I knew what it was. She might be a good customer for the special stuff that is if I could get her away from Gretel long enough to work on her. Oh, what a fucking asshole. Jesus, what did Azrakal do? Well, obviously he shot the person. <laughs> no. Fucking scared me, man. Okay. All right, guys. Where should we go next? Hello, hello. How are you? <laughs> um. Are you following me? Yes. Oh, well, hello Ooh, there. Your nose. Pleasure to meet you. I'm Quinn. What? You're not going to tell me how rare it is to see a human in the world? In the underworld? You too, stranger. I know a lot of people around here don't take kindly to humans wandering around, but I've met a lot of your people in my travels. Is there like a memorial around here somewhere? <clears throat> so what is that Mr. Crowley up to? I might know something interesting if you're with How about... How are you say? I... Oh, boy. I don't give away anything for free. Oh. I'm oh, look, I dropped some of these 50 caps in your pocket. There. Crowley has some kind of scam going where he's going to get... He tried to get me to kill these three guys, but I wouldn't do it. I've met Dave, and he's no more of a ghoul bigot than I am. Hmm. Yeah, just east of here. Bunch of guys with guns are holed up there. Later. Oh, I'm an evil person. Yes, 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 yes. I'm an evil person. Yes, I am. Apparently, I'm still good. I used to be very good, though. Ah, fuck it. <coughs> yeah, exactly. Enjoying your stay. You probably look the most normal out of all of oh. them. Oh, hey, look at that. A human with hair. Hey, you think we can do something about... About what, my hair? Yeah, man, that's what I do. I cut hair. All right, I love this guy, too. I know, that I know the robot. around here, and there ain't a lot of work to show off, right? Snowflake, you so cool. has only got half a head of this stuff, so I never get a chance to work on a full head. Come on, no charge. What can you tell me about Mr. Crowley? I know he doesn't sell jet. Bastard. You want to know about Crowley? Go ask Quinn or Greta. I don't follow the gossip around here like they. How does a ghoul end up as a barber? I prefer stylist myself, but whatever works for you. Everyone has a gift, you know? I used to live in Rivet City. Folks there had enough money for me to do okay. But after I, uh, 
changed. No one would let me touch them. I ended up here. Of course, a ghoul with a barbershop makes about as much sense as a screen door on a submarine, so... Fuck it. I just took up Jet. At least it passes the time, you know? Are you taking Jet? Well, yeah. So, what else do I have to do except get high? <laughs> you think that I need to be sober to cut a ghoul's hair? Half the work is cutting the skin off. These guys don't care how they look anyway. They just humor me. How about a haircut? Sorry. I'm way too gone to cut hair right now. Maybe late. Oh, you suck. You're just talking about it, and then you're like, eh, I don't feel like it. Don't look at Kara. 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 I got something to talk about with you. Yeah? Yeah. Do you know Mr. Crow? The back room renter? Oh, he's a swell guest. So polite to never gets mad at anyone. I've been letting that room to him for about a year now. Well, I never. You. What? Yeah. What? <laughs> Good to see you. You don't have rooms, do you? Please. You literally just have beds. Oh well, it's better than nothing. Let's sweet. I don't know. Wee, does this hurt me? No. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh. One pink gun. One red scorpion. Four pink gun. Oh, one tiger. Right, okay. Oh, I already have the blueprint for this scrub. Thank God I didn't buy another one. Um, a free man, a new man. What? Despite the harshness of the wasteland, I've discovered in more than a few here a compassion that is unheard of in the Commonwealth. Perhaps it's the daily struggle for life here which gives appreciation for life in general, whether human or android. In a few days, I'll be a free man. A new man. Let me say thank you now for referring me to Pinkerton at Rivet City, because I will not remember any of this soon. Hmm. Yes? Well, hello again. You need something sp- uh, uh, wait. Oh. All right, all right. <laughs> Sometimes he comes by and asks me about the security it. system and stuff. You know, technical details about locks and computers. It's not just chit chat either. He's angling for something, but I don't know what. Talk to Azrakal up at the Ninth Circle. Of uh, okay. Hello. That's not a smooth skin. Oh, a human. Well, hello. Welcome to Underworld Outfitters. It's... It's been so long since I had a... I know you know where this android received his operations. Heard Pinkerton at Rivet City fixed him up good. That robot doesn't even know he's a robot. But they are still after him, so we all better lay low. Does Kelly come in here or not? It's his angle. I'm not going to rat on a customer. What? Oh, uh, right. Ooh. Well, it's better than nothing. <laughs> Crowley has been outfitting himself for some big expedition. He's up to something. But... <sighs> Wastelanders get dumber every... What do you do with money when you, ma what you make down here? Well, we spend it at Carol's or the Ninth Circle. But I don't like it there. The rest we give to Quinn to trade for stuff we need whenever he goes out. Do you know anything about the underworld? Well, yeah, there's a lot of old pamphlets and stuff down here. Oh, really? Here. I've pretty much read Is it that all. what's here? Oh. What's, what, what, was, what, was, what was this place before the ghouls moved in? I'm using them. How did all of the ghouls end up here? They just did. 
Well, isn't it dangerous being this deep in the city? Of course, but not as bad as out there. That's all I needed to know. I could answer my own damn questions, apparently. Jesus. Oh my god, my left ear is killing me. It's been killing me the past couple days. Ah, let me see what you have for sale. Sure thing, human. You're so mean. Oh shit. <laughs> Got a lot of stuff. Wow, holy crap. Uh, we'll get 30. Oh, wait. Boom. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Slave? Oh, Jesus. Slave? I mean, Sharon. We need to talk. Uh, wait. Talk about... Wait. Let's... Wait. Let's... Is there a... Wait, I can't just talk to him? Huh. How's it going? Cause you're as- oh no. <laughs> oh yeah. As- whatever. Is the name of that douche. What time is it in the game? 5.15. And I... It's... It's 5.15 in the game. Okay, when did I start this? Uh, 6? Alright, so it's only been like an hour. Alright, cool. Remember guys, if you're in chat, be sure to say something in the chat box, even if it's just hello. <laughs> I'm lonely. <laughs> lonely. It's fucking dandy. What's down below? Not gonna do that. Oh, want to know? Okay. Where did it say Riley was? Because that's what I'm actually gonna do. I know I read something about Riley's Rangers before. I don't know what exactly. Eh. 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 Welcome to the chop shop. I'm Nurse Graves, Dr. Borrow's assistant. You look pinkish Don't let her that's place's cool. name fool you. The doctor is very good with injuries, dismemberments, and trauma. If you require any stim packs or blood packs, let me know. I require them. You know, the doctor got to much anything to him. He's not my type. Doc Borrow's is friendly with him, though. Why don't you ask him? Dr. Barrows, at your service. Come to lend me a hand, I hope. I can always use fresh humans. Uh, what? You haven't heard? I'm the foremost authority on ghoul evolution. I want to know what makes us tick. Something doomed us to this rotting form, and I aim to discover what it is. 
So, huh. I need samples of human skin, organs, and other parts to make the experiments valid. Pity. Well then, what can I do for you? Okay, what do you know about Mr. Fresh? Nothing. Why? What have you heard? You've heard... Yeah. Yes, what is it now? <laughs> I need medical supply. Nope. Yeah. So you're Riley. I'm afraid she's going to be out for a while. She's not well at all. Don't worry though. I'm sure the rest of Riley's ranges will show. Alright, what's wrong? She, you're new to. Oh goodness. What's wrong with her? She had multiple lacerations, contusions, broken leg. Some internal bleeding and blunt force. Sounds like she got beat up. She hasn't been conscious since they brought Bye. her in a few days ago. A super mutant. I'd say she tangled with some super yeah. mutants and lost. It's a miracle she isn't dead. No, I'm sorry. I will. Yes, what is it now? Please. Tell me about Riley's Rangers. They're a mercenary group. I've seen them pass through Underworld a few times. I'm not sure what their mission entails, but I suspect that it involves... The Rangers have a small headquarters not far from here. Let me program the location into your pit boy. Okay. It would be... The sudden shock to her system could provoke... You are probably going to find out what may even help Very it. well. Sweet. This is against my better judgment, but so be it. I just hope she has the strength to cope. <sighs> what? Where am I? What happened? Wish they had better animations. How long have I been out? Uh, well, this Fallout 3 came out a long ass time ago. Uh. Oh, since this planet is a lush green paradise once again. Huh? What the hell are you talking about? If my guys were here... Oh, shit. My team! <laughs> I'm what an the asshole. hell happened? Uh, I don't see it in any condition to be up and about. That's not the way I do things. Do you have any idea what it would do to my reputation if word got around that Riley of Riley's Rangers was laid up? Riley's oh, Rangers, huh? Here, here. Oh, not the... My other dangers. Ooh, I could be the. <laughs> My apologies. I didn't know who you were. That's okay, kid. Don't sweat it. The wasteland's a big place. We're guns for hire. The best merc group in the capital wasteland. If you need something done in there, you seek us out. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have looked at this. Okay. <laughs> Let's skip all this. Wow, Riley, you look like shit. <laughs> Let's skip all the story. And get to the point. Who do you? What do you need? Look, Carol. Maybe I shouldn't have woken you up. So, what's this about needing? You. <laughs> we were mapping the Vernon Square part of the downtown ruins so and got up. jumped by a super mutant ambush party. Usually, it isn't a problem, but this group was bigger than usual. We fought our way into Our Lady of Hope Hospital, hoping to find cover. Let me guess. More super mutants inside. Skip all the story. Get to the point. What do you need? You got it. More of the ugly <laughs> bastards serious. just kept coming. We fought our way to the roof and found a way across to the Statesman Hotel next door. <clears throat> the super mutants seemed driven, like they smelled blood. They kept following us. Once in the hotel, the only way to go was up. Put yourself at the top of a tall building. Let's skip. I'll start to get to the floor. Uh. Look, I don't know what your problem is, but I got three guys alone out there with an army of. Either help me by listening or get the hell out of my sight. Oh, sorry. I geez. am not here to be judged by. Now, like I was saying, <laughs> we had to fight Whoops. our way up towards the roof of the statesman. Uh, skip those two. Okay, whatever I'm guessing. Very bad move, but we had no choice. On the way, we lost Theo, one of my guys. We were unable to get the ammo case off of his body as we were pushed onwards. So, guns almost dry. We hit the roof of the statesman. Did you set any kind of traps or mines? Actually, we did lay down a bunch of countermeasures. 
I don't know how many of them have already gone off, though. When I slipped out with my stealth boy, I think I almost tripped one or two of them. Damn near didn't make it out of there at all, come to think of it. You've been in a coma. Chances are the rangers are already... Why don't you attempt to rescue? Your leg's broken or <laughs> No. There is no way my guys are dead. If there's even the slimmest chance of surviving, they'll do it. Right. If you won't go, stop wasting my oh, oh, fucking time Jesus. and find me Jesus someone lady. who will. Calm the fuck down. Oh my god. Get the rangers home. Please. That's all I want. I don't care how you do it. That's it for me if I was going to defeat it. I don't know really. Uh, alright, alright. I'll, I'll... Yes. I'll do it. Whew. I was holding my breath on that one, I think. I wasn't sure what you were going to say. Fuck you is what I was going to say. All I ask is that you hurry. I don't know how much longer they will be able to survive up there. I also recommend you try and find the body of Theo, one of my men. He was carrying our main ammo supply. Here, let me punch the ammo box code in some better direction than your pit boy there. <laughs> can you think of anything that will help me get there? What can you tell me about Vernon Square? How did this all happen? Riley! Tell me more about Riley's range. Uh. We were mapping the Vernon Square part of the downtown uh -huh. ruins. It got jumped by a super mutant. Usually it isn't a problem. Yeah, then, yeah. I left... Okay, okay. Basically the same shit you just said. If I wasn't asking for your help, I'd tell you to stay away. It's thick with super mutants. I don't know why. Butcher, our team medic, has always suspected something's in the area they are looking for or being attracted to. The only place worse I can think of is the mall. Mm-hmm. How can I get there from the underworld? Your best bet is to stay with the metro tunnels. Head north from here to Metro Central. Then look for the tunnels to the DuPont Circle Station. Exit from the DuPont Circle Station into what we call the Dry Sewers, and eventually you'll wind up in Our Lady of Hope Hospital. Any good news about the area? Not much, I'm afraid. <laughs> oh, wait. The hospital may have some supplies that will help you. We saw some storerooms on the way to the roof, but didn't have time to raid them. Okay, okay go. You we have a headquarters not me? far from here. If you can make it there, you're welcome to anything you need inside. Just punch in Riley 0247 at the gate. We have ammo, supplies, you name it. Okay. Watch yourself. Cool. Saving again. Enjoying your stay. No, no, I'm not. Alright, now then, time to load. Let's actually, yeah, let's load this real quick. Oh, jeez. <gasps> God damn! I am sick of this. I am sick of that. <coughs> sick of that bullshit. Terrible air down. Some bullshit. Fucking jumping up in my face. Bullshit. How's my armor? Okay, not that. That. Okay, time to switch to this. Okay. Yo, you. What's up, tourist? Yo. You know anything about Riley's Rangers? No? Okay. See ya. Choo choo! Okay. Okay. Be cautious. Why? How tall are you? You're like. You're taller than me, aren't you? Quite a bit. You're very tall for a ghoul. You got this line. The, the, the height of. You're just like staring at me like, fuck you, man. Fuck you. Fuck you. Your eyes are like, I don't give a fuck. Mm. 
so we know about Riley's Rangers. We have to hurry, right? Hurry and not help right now. Because we have more important things to do. And now I got backup too. So I can do this more easily. And I'm wearing a rather hideous outfit. <laughs> Wait, what am I trying to do? Hold on. Why is there a side objective? With whatever. Oh. Nope. Galaxy News Radio. Gotta go to the Museum of Technology. You guys ready for this? You guys ready? Let's go. Oh. Pretty red. Pretty red. Mutilated. Let egg. Mutilated. Here are the latest stuff. Why? Alright. Alright. Oh. What am I looking for? That's what I'm looking for. We're gonna both use a combat shotgun. Because let's face it, it's really good for close quarters. <laughs> 